Hello, my name is Melody Barone and I am an alcoholic addict. Owning her behavior is not something Melody Barron could have done a year ago. Today is different though. In front of her family and friends, the mother of three graduates from the Department of Children and Family Services drug court program, closing the chapter on both her addictions and her case with DCFS. Taking meth at nine months pregnant, you know, even if I didn't know how long I was because I didn't have no prenatal care, it still, you know, it's, it made me feel like an addict. So I could have been somewhere else if DCFS never came into play. It was heart wrenching because uh, as much as we try to, you know, talk to them and, but it, you know, they go their way sometimes. But I'm glad she caught herself before she got into anything worse. So since 2006, DCFS has provided a voluntary treatment option for parents under investigation for reports of substance-related abuse or neglect. Those parents who lose custody of their children for drug or alcohol-related offenses can enroll in the department's intensive 12-month program that boasts over 250 graduates to date. Our program is successful because we do a lot of the collaborative work with the different team members of the parent. 25 to 30 families participate in the program each year. On graduation day, DCFS celebrates the parent's achievement in completing drug court. Once they've gained sobriety, they can reunite with their children. It might be graduation day, but it's not an easy road to this diploma. Parents are required to attend 12 hours of education and support sessions each week for a full year in order to get to this point. Participants must attend a minimum of three hours of drug education, relapse prevention and support groups per week, meet with a drug counselor once a week and receive drug and alcohol testing three times a week. But at the end of the day, it's worth it because parents like Melody Barron walk out of the Edmund D. Edelman Children's Courthouse rehabilitated and reunited with their children, the very reason they worked so hard to overcome their addictions. In Monterey Park, I'm Jackie Karsh.